I look crazy. <laughs> hey guys, I'm hot. I got my bonnet on and I just got done making dinner. We just got done making dinner. It is late and I was going to mukbang, but I decided not to. We just did some air fryer chicken. I did John Legend's um, chicken because y'all know he like kind of known in the streets for his chicken. And I've done his recipe before and it's good. And I just never done it in the air fryer. How you like it, baby? He, he just took a bite. It's hot. Very hot. Very good. But I'm going to show y'all my plate, and then I'm going to probably take a bite, and then I'm probably going to let y'all go because it's hot, and we just going to eat <laughs> savagery. And I didn't feel like setting up everything for mukbanging, but I'll let y'all see my plate. There you go. This is, I made some hot water cornbread for the first time. The first batch didn't come out good. This came out good. This is the chicken, the John Legend chicken. This is, um... Leftover lentil from my Ethiopian food and leftover goman from my Ethiopian mukbang, which is uh, kale. And then I have I have some um, macaroni and cheese that I have froze, and I just uh, defrosted and put. And I also have some coleslaw that I'm going to eat as well. But I just want y'all to see me eat my first bite of chicken. Chicken. Y'all, we went to the grocery store today, and it was crazy because they was like, um, it wasn't that many people there, which was great, but it was crazy because when we went to get our, uh, what's the name, what was it, when we went to get, like, to check out, the dude, we had, we always use our reusable bags, so we got like a million reusable bags, so homeboy was like, oh no, if we were doing a reusable you got a baggage yourself. We were at Jewel, and that was the first time we had ever heard that because yeah, usually, yeah, the day before, like, day, a few days ago, y'all, it wasn't like that. So stuff keep changing on the, yeah. like, with the you know the Rona stuff be changing. But uh, my one of my good friends, Mashama, hey Mashama, if you watching, girl, she said that they doing that down where she at too. But I was like, dang it. But y'all, <clears throat> let me explain my procedure. When we come in the house from being outside, we go outside or whatever, come back in with whatever bags we have. We take off the stuff that we we have on. We uh go, we have, usually sometimes we have the Lysol by the door. If not, we go get the Lysol, spray, we don't touch nothing. We don't touch another door handles or nothing. We spray everything down. We spray our bags down. We spray, like, y'all, it's serious. <laughs> so, we take good precaution. So, it was crazy that they were trying to play us. Now I'm just playing. But, you know, a lot. I saw a whole bunch of fools up in the store acting a fool. Like, we saw some dudes up in there just uh, drinking pops and stuff, walking around. And I'm like, see, this is why people had these precautions. Um, or why they're putting so much stuff out because yeah, you drinking people, your beverages you just in here drinking and eating stuff, touching your mouth. It was ridiculous. It's just flying out of your mouth and shit. Right, and then the cashiers they have um, plexiglass um, in front of their stations now. When you come into the line, and baggers will not bag your stuff unless it's fresh plastic from the store. If not, you have to bag it yourself. Now, this is the new changes that I noticed when we went to the store today. It was cool, and I mean, we were walking around. It was pretty empty outside, um, but we were walking around a couple people, and they was coughing, so we let them go way up in front of us. Uh -huh. Let's let them go past. Let them go past. <laughs> so we let them go past, and then now they've been like letting. Dang, they could have ate like half this food, but <laughs> now they've been letting like uh, putting messages over like the intercom in the stores, like please keep like a two car distance or something yeah, feet, or whatever. Well, they were saying they said two. two yeah. Anyway, y'all, sure. this the chicken don't look good in that good old air fryer. Can I hold my hold my food up? Food is hot. Uh -huh. <laughs> this ain't a full mukbang, y'all. Just reporting back to y'all live. No, <laughs> not live, but you know. This chicken. My mom coming over tomorrow, so maybe I'll do a live with her. I haven't seen her since all this stuff started going on. But yeah, she'll be here tomorrow, so maybe we'll do some. Salut. I know I'm saying salut. This chicken. Ooh. 
It's hot still. I talked all that time. It's still hot. In temperature. <clears throat> Ooh, that's good. I got my green. And my hot water. Y'all was my first time making hot water cornbread. My mommy makes it all the time. But I would just make regular cornbread. I don't know y'all. I prefer. I like it, but I prefer regular cornbread. It's mad crispy. And, and I don't like the fact that you gotta fry it, so my whole point is trying to get away from fried fruit fried food. But it's good. The first batch I burnt y'all. I don't use burnt stuff. But I burnt the first batch. Of cornbread. Not nothing else. Mm. But yeah, John Legend's chicken recipe. Ooh, it's good. It was hot. <clears throat> it's delicious, y'all. It, it works in the uh, air fryer. Just make sure you spray your chicken down. Spray it on down. Spray it on down. I sprayed it with um, olive oil. Y'all. What's good? Was is delicioso. Nom nom nom. Mm. I ain't gonna say all night. We out here savagely. It's hot up in here, so I ain't got no shirt on. I don't have that luxury right now to be topless. But <laughs> it'd be nice because it's hot up in this bit. It is hot. I hope y'all doing well and stuff and doing all right. Hope everybody cool. Um, being safe, keeping y'all distance from foods. Because, like, y'all, it's a bunch of foods out here. Who aren't being respectful of stuff. And that's, you know, why the count is rising. Because the fool's sitting here like, oh, I'm throwing a party still. I don't care. Or I'm still hanging out. It don't matter. You smoke with 10 blunts with with the, in the hood all day, every day. Don't cut it. I ain't heard about it all that, but apparently that's the thing I'm talking about. That stuff. But, y'all... Before today, I hadn't even been outside in like two days. Or three, maybe. I don't know, I've been in the house watching Netflix. Mm -hmm. Maybe this is a mukbang. Y'all can't see my food, y'all just seeing me. So, <laughs> so I don't know if that count as a mukbang. But this thing came out so good. Cause I wasn't gonna regularly fry it cause I was like, I was like, I don't know if it's gonna come out as good if mm -hmm. I'm putting the fryer in the regular fryer and a whole bunch of oil. And I was like, let me go buy some oil. But I have seen a whole bunch of people do different, not this recipe, but different recipes right, yeah. in the air fryer. So I was like, I should be able to do that, pull off that. In the air fryer, why not? At least try it. So I tried. It. So I tried y'all. So now y'all know. If y'all was wondering if John Legend's fried chicken recipe working the air fryer, it surely does. All you gotta do is make sure you spray it down with um a spray bottle um with some oil. I spray ours down with some uh, olive oil. So crunchy and crispy and good. Um, spray down whatever oil you choose. I spray ours down with Nathan is done eating this food. But <laughs> you know this my food. You gonna be the pausing so you ain't on camera. No. You ain't gonna be on camera no way because it's not even facing the kitchen, baby. If you want to eat some more food, okay. it's hot. <clears throat> This is good, y'all. And it's, this is a different mix. I ain't never had a this one. Like, usually if I do the Ethiopian food, I keep it Ethiopian all the way through. But we had leftovers. And I was like, man. I'm going to have some chicken. 
instead of fashion and even with that why not so that's what i did y'all and i had some macaroni mm. so i wanted some cornbread but i didn't necessarily want to turn on my whole oven but i ended up turning my oven on anyway so <laughs> whatever but i never made hot water cornbread before So, I want to try making it. I prefer regular cornbread still. But this is still good. On days when I don't want to, for real, turn them out there. Mmm. Yeah, chicken came out delicious. I ain't gonna keep y'all no yeah. much longer. What you gonna say, Nick? The chicken did come out delicious, baby. So. Thumbs up if y'all want to see me make it because John Legend, he do a thing where he brine the chicken. We brine the chicken for like 24 hours. And then we, um, what's the name? Breaded it and fried it in the air fryer. So, if you want to see that process, let me know. Now, I'm looking rough out here in these streets. It's late. We need to, we both need to shower because I've been sitting here, sitting here, cooking food, frying chicken in the air fryer, but it still got hot up in here. But <laughs> this is just us out, y'all. In the house. We just in the house. I didn't get dressed up today. Um I do have a little fancy thing planned. Stay tuned for in the house because you know we just I just miss getting dressed a little bit. So and I don't get dressed up often but we not about to be able to go nowhere or this stay at home order has been extended. So um, we gonna do a little fancy thing in the house while we here. Stay tuned for that. Anyway, y'all. Love you, love you, love you. Peace. Hope y'all doing well. Hope everybody's safe. Wash your hands, doing all that, y'all. Like we all in this together. Let's just work through this. Like <laughs> y'all, it's surreal, but we just got to work through this. Again, love you, love you, love you. Peace. Bye. Bye, y'all.